Welcome back everybody to the next episode of World of Final Fantasy. We're just going to continue where we were last time, which is talking to the Conductor Kakor. Right, tickets please! Mm-hmm. Go on then, all aboard! God, I love that Cicero. When I do a real... We would like to take a moment now to kindly remind all our passengers to remain in their seats facing forward. Please fasten your seatbelts at this time. Seatbelts on a train? What are they for? Oh my god, that's adorable! Don't see that every day. Three, two, lift off! <laughs> Why does this world's transportation have to be so... Little cutie pie. <gasps> oh, it's our mirage. Wow. Oh. A lot of the sharks, some of those eels we have. That's cool. That is cool. I wonder if we'll see Yuna, since this, is, since this is where she's from. Also, I'd like to bring in the large version of the shark wall at some point. See how it does, how it compares to uh, my Aloha hydro thingy. Aloha, and a warm welcome to the Empyrium. Oh, I am the loving this weather. It makes me just want to laugh out loud. I have no idea how to react to that, so I'm just gonna ignore you. Oh, now, God. what do you say we head for that town over there? <laughs> Why? Why would they do like it just sounded perfectly What is happening here? What are you cuties doing? Why did they do that to me? Five star curtains, that's actually really good. Damn it, game. Why would you do the Titus laugh? Why? Anyway, I said I want to do the shark ball thing, so let's first access the prism case. Um, trade you for the shark ball, if I can, there you are. Then evolve said shark ball. So you are 129 and you're 191. I mean, he's also a lot of levels above him, but still. Okay, you are going to be a higher strength, but you're also faster. Um, hmm. Keeping the party thing for now. Can I ride it? Nope. If an enemy slows you in battle, you won't be able to take action as often. Oh, Haste magic will fix you lickety split, but if you don't have that, you can still recover by using a gold hourglass. You get some? Here, yes. this one's for you. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. All right. Well, uh, Port Besaid. What if the Orox are practicing? Lord knows they need to practice. I was about to say, I'm not getting the place wrong, am I? But nope, this is. Moko is in Chocobo, is in Machina ruins in the background. Okay, we've got a temple in the deep to find. Why don't we start by asking around? 
Hey, nice pot. A sunken temple? Oh yeah, everyone around here has heard about it. But since no one's ever been there, who can say if it actually exists? Fair point. Make a fair point. Um... You know what? No. I want... Let's do this. I'm actually curious, what size... Is that other thing? Well... Oh, there you are. Also, what's where? Oh, there you are. I was like, what the fuck? You're also large. Interesting. So you're the magic one, and you're the. F oh. I like that. I really like that. I like the fish on his head. Well, let's talk to people. This letter just isn't enough. Only I had. Wait, you wouldn't happen to be Mirage Keepers, would you? We are. I'm looking for some fish scales. You wouldn't happen to have any you can spare, would you? Not a clue. Oh, yeah, I do have them. Haha. <sighs> <sighs> Thanks a bunch. Now I'm finally confident enough to give her my letter. What do I need them for? Well, I'm going to use them to decorate my proposal letter. It's like, that's almost a it's fucking kind chrono of a cross tradition. reference. We believe that when you ask someone to marry you, giving them fish scales will ensure they say yes. You do the Komodo scales. Don't laugh. The girl I you love. It. I know that fish scales aren't exactly the first thing that comes to mind when people think about romance, but if you ever really looked at them, they're one of the most beautiful things out there. They actually are really anyway, pretty. Anyway, you really helped me out. Here, this is for you. Ooh. That's good. Uh, does Shiva... No. Yeah, does Shiva have any blank spaces? I believe she does. I need two points to do it, though. So, we'll get there. What do you have to say, Mr. Uh, Basket? The sunken temple, huh? Boy, wouldn't it be something if it were real? I don't know who'd actually want to live there, though. That was insightful. Uh, let's look at our map. Okay, that looks like the right way to go, so we're going to go with a hopefully not the right way. What's that? You'd like to know more about the sunken temple? Oh, I'm so sorry, but I'm afraid there just isn't much I can tell you. I've met all sorts of visitors here during my lifetime, but you're the first to ever ask me about the sunken temple right off the bat. She sounds like she's ready to tell me to stay away from the summoner. Well, it sounds like everyone's heard about the temple we're after. Thing is, none of these people have actually been there. What'd you expect? It's the temple in the deep. You think people would call it that if it was swimmable? Fair point. From the look of it, the train probably doesn't stop there either. Huh? Pan... to Logist. Always here to assist? Wow! A person that studies the pants? They think of the everything. Yeah. Pants must be serious business. It's Pantologist, dummy. The prefix is Pan. Cookware, huh? Neat. Uh, Not those pans. As in all. Like, they do a little of everything. Oh. Yep. Well, if they do a little of everything, then maybe they can do a little of helping us get down to that sunken temple. Maybe. Let's Find hit the out. pants. W wait, Mon! The curse makes it less worse. Hmm. What does that mean? That looks like the place. Why was I shoved into large mode? Doesn't matter, I need to use it. Remedy plus. Um, 
There's that little cute thing over there. Well, let's go into the Poseidon Laboratory. Is it gonna be Lulu? She would curse people. Come on, where's our goth? Where's our goth? Oh, it's gonna be someone from Final Fantasy 11 slash 14. Now the test will surely end in success. <laughs> yeah, it's the Lollafell. Or whatever they were called in Final Fantasy 11. I'm not sure which um, one it is. Was I a quart of ingredients short? Service, please! <laughs> Lon, ever heard of manners? Who goes there? Oh my, I rarely cross paths with a giant pair. So tell me, are you the Pan Mighty person from the ad? Yes, that's the gist. How can I assist? The sunken temple? Yes. I don't know, maybe you could give us a magic spell, you know, something that lets us breathe underwater? Maybe some magic pants? Breathe underwater? Whether it's gills or spells you want, a solution can be met, but the sea is its own kind of hell. You're almost certain to regret. The currents will leave you blind, and it's so big you'll be bored out of your mind. Wow. Th that's discouraging. Well, hang on. We can handle a little certain regret. Uh, yeah. If you know a solution, then we'd really appreciate it if you could help us out. So come on, please? Hmm. Well, if you're quite certain that that is your desire, perhaps you're just what I require. I don't like that she talks in rhyme. Excellent. We'll start with the dunce. You see, you can't do two total losers at once. Wow, what the feck are you doing? Can't breathe. Lon! Hey, what's wrong? What did you do to him? There, there. He simply can no longer breathe air. Why not? Oh, come now, darling, use your head. You wanted to swim like the fishes, you said. But a fish out of water is soon to be dead. Get in the water! Some kind of murderer? Oh my. After I do you a favor, this is how you choose to repay me. Oh dear. Don't make me angry. What the fuck is happening? Her magic power is the incredible. Rain, maybe you should consider the apologizing? What? But I. She. Uh, please forgive me? One of those unwinnables. Oops, didn't mean to do that, but that's fine. It's gotta be an unwinnable. Uh, but let's give it a go, anyways. Blazaja. Three hundred damage. Yep, it's unwinnable. Has to be. It's not. I call bullshit. Please tell me that was story related. Phew! I was about to say, are we in those barrels? Do we get a tail? Breathe! Breathe! He's all into it. He's like, what up, Pam? Oh, you've decided to awake. Well, off you go with these two flakes. Ah. You got it. What up, butt face? Is he gonna blitz ball us? Oh, he's a good stacker. That's right, Titus never has to breathe underwater, which is weird. 
Just found Waka. Or Kimari. Oh, Chibi Kimari would be hilarious. Oh my god, please don't be three dimensional. Whoa, check it out! We're in the ocean and we're actually breathing! I hope you like it, because we can't breathe anywhere else. Don't you worry. I've been to the sunken temple a bunch of times. Bet you have. That you have. But just a minute. Does this mean we can't return to Ninewood Hills? Oh, you can still go the back there. Hey, I didn't know you could breathe underwater too. <laughs> Don't go there confusing me with your average mortal. I'm special. Of course okay, you are. Okay, but then why didn't you just go to the temple for us? What? Are you the crazy? Every the inch between us and that key is crawling with the mirage of barrages. I mean, a barrage of mirages. Probably. If you sit me in there alone, I'd get annihilated. Sorry. So, did you mean it when you said that we could go back to Ninewood Hills? Well, that place isn't just immune to the time. It can dispel the magic and other mystical manipulations. Hmm. So, that means you can go back to Ninewood Hills without the choking to death. That's always good. Thank goodness. Although, I guess that means we won't be able to travel anywhere else, huh? Yeah. Nah, let's just finish our dunk to the sunken temple, and... Wait, if we find the key, will we change back? Oh, don't worry. Dr. Shantoto gave me the antidote to the curse. Nice! <sighs> what a relief. I thought we'd end up stuck like this. Wait, did you say curse? What a mental. No map. Cha. Yeah. I mean, curses are the doc's specialty. Hope I'm uh, going the right first, way. we've heard of that. Well, as long as she's planning on fixing us up. Sort of. You see, the doc said, Tell those twin losers the antidote costs, so bring me a quacho ruby or they can get lost. So good luck. I'm not crossing her. That's fair. She said all that? Twin losers? What? Where did she get off calling me a loser? Lon is the loser here! Rude! You're mad about the name calling? Question for you. What the exactly is a quacho, Ruby? Good, good, oh, good question. Point. What is a quacho? A quacho? Oh, there's some right over there. Their queen cries red tears, which are called quacho rubies. That's sad. Now I see. But those sound like they must be just about impossible to get. True enough. They say she only sheds one tear every decade. The rubies go for at least a hundred million gil. Wow. Uh, I swear, that is the last time I ever consult a pantologist. Hey, uh, Titus, how come you can breathe underwater? I'm gonna say Titus still. Well, if you've tossed enough blitz balls around. Eh? What? Hmm. Eh, I'll tell you about it some other time. Oh, fuck you. They were like, oh, we don't want to have to develop lore for why he can breathe underwater, so we're just going to do that. That's bullshit. Well, I can interact with these little guys down there. Can I even go down there? Nope, that's an invisible wall. Oh, hey, look, a sunken temple. A temple that is sunken. A temple of the water sunkenness and the under sunken waterness. Hey, there it is. Yeah, I can see that. Titus. All right, the, ooh, a whale. A sunken temple. Am I gonna have to do three recordings in a row? I don't want to stop midway through. Okay, I'll be waiting back at the surface. Bet you Good luck face. finding that Quacho Ruby. Yep, got it covered. Even snow hey, stayed with just us. Just don't forget why we originally came here. You know, if we found enough of them, we could all be filthy, stinking the rich. Oh, I like your style, Tama. Hear that? We're gonna find a Quacho zillion rubies. No, we're not. I'll say it again. Don't forget why we're here. Wonder if, uh, what this Let's is gonna be like. Let's just find the key, get the ruby we need, and trade for the antidote. Rubies, rubies, baby, I wanna be a Quacho zillionaire. 
Is that even a song? Um, so in case we do die, I do not want to go through all that again. Because that you're, obviously you're not going to be able to skip through movement dialogue. So yeah, that's there you go. That's done. So is this like the underwater section that began in Final Fantasy X? Is it from another Final Fantasy? Hey, Let me know in the comments. We can walk. Does that mean we're not underwater anymore? Then that means the curse has been... Oh. Okay, wishful thinking. Mm. Right. But, like, shouldn't we be floating? Hmm. I think that this temple must have some kind of special the power. Don't ask me the how it works, but I sense some kind of force that keeps people and mirages from the drifting too far away. Hey, you're right. Something's keeping us way down. But on the bright side, it's just like being on solid the ground. That's especially the helpful for you two, right? Yeah. Also, this is just the wild guess, but... Whoa! No way! In some areas, oh, the walls have their own the gravity, which lets us do cool the stuff like this. Puzzles! Oh, hey. All right, what can we encounter here? At first, I was like, Ladies whoa, and dummies first. Hey, here? new kind of uh, shark wall. Mirage. Let's take this one out to breakfast. Uh, Libra Night Squall. Uh, inflict sleep. We actually can do that. Uh -huh. Yawn. Da -da. I wonder if sleeping things makes them easier to imprison. Like it does in Pokemon. Yes! Justice! We did it! I'm using like a big camo giant fish thing. Good experience here, my dudes and dudettes. Alright, a shark hole in jungle camo. Watch out for those sneak attacks. Wait, hold on a second. How does jungle camouflage even work outside the jungle? Talk about a fish out of water. So you are a strength whore as well, but also great in speed and agility. What do you learn? Um, Hydro Twister, Ambush, Reteeth, Water Spout, Joyride, First Strike... Lots of strength and actually and evasion. No magic except for on its next one. That's actually quite nice. All right, we're gonna. Looks good. Bring this dude into the party. Well, not the party, but he's gonna come along with us. Worry about it. Get the fuck out of my face. You disappoint me. I have to. What does that do? Uh, organize. Pick me up, pick me up inside. Pick me up inside, man. Something like that, right? Um. So we need to get the Fl Princess Goblin because she's special. Um. Oopsie. You a key item? The fuck's a dazzle disc? Give me a golem treasure, gotcha. Now I don't even remember what the name of the thing was called that we picked up. Um. A pick me up, something like that? I probably. Maybe I just already have something like it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm pretty sure ninjas are supposed to be quiet. Remember why we're here. To the find that ruby! Baby! I don't wanna be a quacho zillionaire! Don't, don't. No, it was something about a key. Why you gotta teach Tom of bad songs? Ooh, new mirage once again. Oh gosh, yeah, he can take him out on his own. So what we will do is... Eh, we can do it now. Really. Just barely. So let's find out what we gotta do to snag this. Actually, no. Yeah. 
Let's just find out. I'm just afraid of reaching that limit. Use water attacks. I don't think I have any with this lot. Nah. So I'm gonna just say screw it. Toss a win. No trouble at all. All the trouble in the world. Just trouble. I really do need to diversify my magic pool, though, to be, to be honest. I'm being honest with you guys. No, it was something about a key. Okay, nothing down there. I can just go around? I can just go around. <gasps> Sorry, I forgot about that. Good job. A remedy. I'll take it. I'll definitely take it. Okay, there's a chest. Here we go! Don't believe I still have lure on. Let's see how ice does against this lot. A lot of resist. Well, duh, they resist it. Oh shit! I thought I got my screen while of spout. Okay, so they weak to fire. That's cool. How only I had if it's about. Wait, didn't I learn from fear? Oh, that was with uh, the bomb I learned, Fira. That's right, that's right. So, let's actually do that. More wobble stoppers. They're not bad to have. Oh, shit, now I've got to look on, like, multiple areas. Like, you know. Oh, I could have just done that. Interesting. Ooh, good crit, my- Ooh, God, twice! Oh, yeah. And my single combat, nothing but crits. Nothing but them. Dig it. For Chacho, you are, uh, leveling up well, my dude. At 41 already. Alrighty. Well, let's get on up here. Get on the side. Go on down. I like to look at the map. Alright, so we're going to go to the left side of this stairwell first. Back attack. What is happening when that thing happens? Good, we resisted it. Um, let's do that. Any AoEs? Fira. Single, single, single. Oh, hey, we have water attacks. Cool. Very good. We are going to use Ice Storm because it will make Lon one shot at this point. Definitely not with that Ice Spike. It won't, though. Not with her, I should say. Oh, yeah, we were faster. Take it in no the trouble place. at all. Hey, right, Cole, you're doing quite good. I'm actually going to get that boy uh, Joyride real quick so we can vent my joy. Do I have something in Joyride? I do not. So, where are you? There you be. Okay. Stop doing the thing. Water. Evasion. Oh, there you are. Joyride. Might as well get strength. Thank you. Wow. That's quite good. Accuracy evasion. First strike. That's nice. Um. Anyone important have anything? Eh, not really. There we go. Now we can do this again. Well, let's just go snag this chest. Oh, you're a mimic, aren't you? Oh, no. Three lightning marbles. I'll take that in a heartbeat. Lovely stuff. But, ladies and gentlemen, the... Okay, hold on. We'll end the episode after this combat, in which we will do an ice gun, and then start just punching people in the face. Dude, don't be rude. Okay, okay. Sit down. God, I am tired. I need to eat. That's what I need. I need food. Predictable. But I gotta keep recording. Because I don't have a safe spot. Oh well. But yes, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Once again, I absolutely am adoring this game. 
and I will see you in the next episode. So, bye-bye for now.